I've heard that pace loan possibility, that option, come up in a lot of different situations. And this friend of yours is the per first person that I, you know, I've come that close mm -hmm. to knowing who has actually used it. Real estate, agent man. The next topic of conversation has to do with pace loans. Yes. Yes. And uh, I, I think Katrina looked into a pace loan once for a customer and I didn't know all the details of it, but you know, she had said, this is not going to be a good situation for this particular customer. Mm -hmm. But from what you've learned from it, it sounds like everybody needs to be cautious. Yeah, it's definitely, it's a lifesaver. Okay, let's get it's you closer to the mic again. It's a lifesaver. It's important that it's there. Okay. And it's some people's only choice and it's their only option. And in that case, yes, definitely use it. But the experience that I've seen with it, it's just that if it's not your only option, this is information you should know. So the, uh, the air conditioner went up in July in Florida. That's not a good thing. This is actually that same house. Same house. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so. One house, several learning experiences. experiences. Definitely. Yes. So the only option, and I mean the only option, was to go with the PACE loan to have the air conditioner replaced. And at the time when they came to do the work, it became very apparent that the ductwork should be replaced as well. That was a decision made by the homeowner. It wasn't something that the, um, you know, the air conditioner company recommended or anything like that. So long story short, both were replaced. The total cost of the project was Ten thousand three hundred and seventy-two dollars. That's for the AC and ductwork. That's for the AC and the ductwork. Okay. And that was done in two thousand nineteen, July. The payment for that was basically roughly a hundred dollars a month, and it comes out of your taxes. And when your escrow pays the tax every year, it pays thirteen hundred and some dollars towards the pay loan. So when this person got ready to sell the house, and you know they needed all the documents for closing. My assumption was, okay, you know, we've got three and a half, four years worth of $1,300 payments. That's, you know, 4000 some dollars. That's how much less that's going to be. And we sh this should go to like maybe $6,000. So the payoff comes from the PACE program. For the sale, and which for the, was last month. For the sale, yes. So we're talking about, uh, let's see, what did I have here? Three years, eight months of paying that uh, loan off. The original... After they added their fees and everything, the original balance was $12,000. So in the three years and eight months, the payoff was $10,241. $100 less than the project cost in the original um, when it was done. Okay, wow. So basically they paid $4,600 and the actual cost of the project only lowered $100. Now, if you have no choice, you have no choice. And if you, now we're talking about three or four years. This pace loan was for, it was either 10 or 15 years. By the time this was paid off, you probably would have paid $20,000, $20, maybe for this $10,000 project. That's heavy. Yeah. So, yeah, how disappointing that was to know that, <laughs> you know, they, they'd been paying on it for three and a half years. And it's $100 less than what the cost was. Correct. I see why that would have to be like an absolute last resort. Mm -hmm. I'd almost be tempted to just live with box fans if at all possible. I know that would be tough in the summer. Maybe in Minnesota. Maybe. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that could have worked. Uh, Minnesota would probably be the heater that went. Right. <laughs> I thought windows were involved in... Windows, it. roof. It's, the, it's anything that is... Um, so you can Energy you related, can get it for windows yeah. and okay. windows, the roof, air conditioning, duct work. I think that's it. So some very important things. Very important things. I'm sure a lot of people have had to use it with you know hurricane damage on the roof and stuff like that. And if you don't have a choice, then it's your only option. Right. But you're you're backing away from the mic. I would assume that <laughs> you know if you could afford to pay more than the payment, that probably wouldn't end up being the same situation but it's just something to definitely realize especially if you're going to sell in three or four years yeah. you're going to be paying a lot of money to something that isn't even you're still going to owe the same amount of money on 
basically three thousand and some dollars worth of interest and yeah. fees. Yeah. All right. Well, listeners, viewers, you're glad you're <laughs> tuned in today, aren't you? <laughs> Because it's, you know, most of us know somebody who is kind of in, in need at one point or another of things like this. And I've heard that pace loan possibility, that option, come up in a lot of different situations. And this friend of yours is the per first person that I, you know, I've come that close mm -hmm. to knowing who has actually used it. Yeah, now I have more information to give my future customers as they're thinking about it. Last resort only you know it reminds me of when i was 18 years old and i got uh abc warehouse i think was the name of the uh the store and it was just it was a detroit thing i don't know where else they they were but you know this was in the uh the mid 80s when your stereo speakers stood this <laughs> tall right and so i went in and with my abc credit card i got this seriously cool home stereo system in fact, when I met my wife and she came to my apartment the first time, <laughs> that was my shining jewel in the place. So by the time I paid that off, I think I paid like $2,500 for that $1,000 stereo. Yep. Just think Finger Hut. Same thing. Same thing. It's like buying an air conditioner from Finger Hut. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Great. Okay. So, hey, you know, you got any more questions on this topic? Give me a call. I'll give you Jen's number. No. <laughs> No, I won't do that. So, um, thank you, Jen. You're welcome. Thank you for having it. me. You're welcome. Stay.